So many of us out there have business ideas, but having a business idea only is not enough. What creates a difference is being able to execute it and create something out of it. So in today's video, we are going to be sharing about practical tips that can help you launch out your business out there and be able to make some good money out of it. Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Karunji Josephine and I'm so glad to have you here. If it's your first time here, you're very, very welcome. Thank you so much for joining the community and for my returning subscribers. Thank you so much for coming back to watch these interesting videos. Last week I shared about, you know, business ideas that you can actually start without money. So no excuses here that you don't have money, you know, something like that. So how about you actually put your ideas to action but what do you need to actually have what tips can you you know exercise so that you can be able to launch out your business out there and be able to make some good money out of it that's what we're going to be sharing today so the very first tip that i have here is do enough research before thinking about launching your business out there make sure that you have enough knowledge about it if it is a service-based business who are these people that are going to be you know giving these services to what do they like most what do they not like what are these challenges that you're most likely to face and how will you maneuver them and all that make sure that you have enough knowledge because you know what this is going to help you be able to reach out to the right audience to the right customers because not everyone is actually your customer not everyone is going to be able to buy your product or be able to benefit from the services that you're providing to them so make enough research who are the people that are going to be your customers or your clients and what do you need to actually offer to be able to satisfy them and how are you going to be you know pricing your products look at the pricing look at the marketing all this is going to help you be ready and prepared and not fear because you know exactly where to start from if you have enough research you won't be you know second guessing things you will be doing things because you have made enough research about them and the biggest reason why most of us actually fear to launch out there fear to start up you know these particular businesses or put them to work is because we don't have enough research we are scared you're like what if i start it and it doesn't work out so if you have enough knowledge about it if you've done enough research it is going to help you to you know be grounded and know where exactly to start from and then another tip is create a plan and a marketing strategy after making your research very well are you going to create adverts are you going to start you know telling people on social media about this particular business and are you going to you know there are a lot of things that you can do to strategize and create a plan because if you have a plan first of all you're not going to also second guess things and you're going to do things you know when you're organized so have a plan before launching out your business out there who are these people that are going to help me out who do i need you know first of all because sometimes you need someone to give you some knowledge you need someone to give you a hand when you have a plan of how you're going to market when you strategize it will be easy for you to find clients it will be easy for you to be able to reach out to the right audience of people who will be able to consume what you're selling out to them another tip is to actually start from where you are yes start from where you are with whatever you have the reason why some of us actually fear to launch out there is because we want this something big maybe you have seen this particular business out there and it is already successful you're scared you think you can't actually you know start because you don't have enough resources and all that you can start from where you are i always tell people to actually start with their phones because you know what i started my youtube channel here with my phone which wasn't actually that good it did it didn't have that good camera you know i'm not where i really want to be but i can say so far i'm you know moving i have seen people start businesses at home and be able to later progress and go out there create physical businesses so if you're looking at starting let me say a bakery business i've seen people bake you know cakes at home i've seen people make those snacks at home and be able to brand them so well so 
a customer won't know that it was actually made at home. You know, there are so many lessons to actually learn when you start small because most of the times you get a lot of challenges. So you learn how to make things the better way. You learn how to do things, you know, in a better way than when you start big. So start where you are and start with what you can actually afford. You don't need to have those expensive, expensive stuff that you can't afford at this moment. But if you can afford it, well and good. If you can't afford it, start with what you have. And then another tip is to consider branding. Branding is going to create you as a unique business. You're going to stand out with what you sell. It involves your packaging, it involves your colors, it involves the kind of things that you do. I know you can now tell that this is a Mkwano product, you can tell that this is an MTN you know, service uh, provider's place. There are a lot of things that you can tell because of you know the branding that businesses have made. So it is easy for you to recognize a certain business because of their branding and that helps them stand out and be able to you know attract the right customers. So branding is a good thing to also start with when you're launching out your business out there. And then another thing is to actually take advantage of social media use social media as much as you can to market yourself out there there are a lot of businesses online and that means that also a lot of clients online so how about you use this opportunity to actually let more other people know about your business about what you sell as i said earlier we are in an era where everyone is actually having a phone a gadget wherever they are in their office at home wherever they go they have gadgets with them so that means if you market yourself out there especially on social media you'll be able to get the right clients for your products or for your services so how about you actually take social media as a marketing strategy for your business so if you already have a business and you don't have an account or a platform for your business you're actually missing out on a lot of clients make sure that you have a platform about your business sell it out to a lot of people and you'll be able to get clients from around the world because social media connects the whole world and then another tip is to actually speak life into your business what you say out is most likely going to manifest our words have the power to create things into existence yes so whatever you say about your business is going to manifest if you're telling you if you're the kind of person that says you know what this is not going to work out i'm just trying out let me just you know let me just do you're not even sure about it that is how it is going to be most of the times what you speak out is what is actually going to manifest so what are you speaking about your business are you speaking about abundance are you speaking about progress are you speaking about growth are you speaking about favor from your customers are you speaking about about having more clients making more profits you know uh, there are a lot of things that you can speak about your business are you speaking about you know leveling up from one level to another are you speaking about um, being able to reach people worldwide internationally and all that so speak life into your business what do you want to see manifest in this particular business you're going to start on or in this particular business that is already you know in place so this is going to also help you be confident in what you're delivering to your people because you know you're delivering quality this is going to help you have a better connection with the clients you have because you know you are highly favored in your business your products are highly favored everyone is going to love them and all that so speak into your business speak life into your business and pray over your business as you're starting it out there make sure that you pray about it and tell God to bless the works of your hands as he says you know this is going to help you be able to launch out there successfully with a lot of confidence and reach the right clients so what words are you speaking into your business you can let me know down into the comment section let me know what are you going to speak over your business and then the last tip is do not change your strategies very fast you know first give them a test if you've tried this particular strategy this you know this month see how it works out see how you know people react towards it see how people be able to buy or what people say about these particular things so do not change strategies so fast because you won't know what is working out for you what is not working out for you you know this is going to help you know and make enough research about your products and how to actually deliver the best things to your clients out there so make sure that you strategize but then do not change your strategies so fast first test them out and see which one is actually working out for you so those are the tips that i actually had for you thank you so much for watching 
today's video if you find it helpful give it a thumbs up let me know down in the comment section what i might have left out or what you think can actually help the rest of us succeed or be able to launch out our businesses successfully yes thank you all for watching and i will see you in the next video